Hi there, welcome to English Mania, and we continue on our series of intermediate grammar. And today our topic is um, present perfect simple and present perfect continuous. Yeah, when do we use that or that tense? So uh, we know about present perfect simple. We discussed it uh, closely in the previous video, so you can go back and to find it in my uh, channel. Uh, and today we're gonna focus more on present perfect continuous. Yeah, uh, just a quick reminder that we use the present perfect simple with the past finished actions or experiences when we don't mention or we don't know when they happened. And we also use it to ask or talk about situations that started in the past and have not finished. Let's talk about present perfect continuous today. So uh, present perfect continuous, yeah, the formula of it is have been plus the verb, like the main verb with ing ending. And you remember that with he, she, it, we use has, yeah, has been uh, the verb with ing ending. If we need to make negative sentence, yeah, we just put not after have or has. And if we need to make questions, we just put have or has at the beginning. So, present perfect continuous we use for actions from the past till now. Yeah, we emphasize the duration. Uh, we use it with action verbs, yeah, like dynamic verbs. Uh, to talk about situations that have not finished or have just finished. And there is often a present result from doing these actions, like you've been crying, it, we see, yeah, that your eyes are red, so we see the result, and that's why we can use present perfect continuous. Or oh, I'm dirty, yeah, because I've been painting, yeah, we see the result, <laughs> and that I'm dirty. Um, then, uh, of course, yeah, we use uh, present perfect continuous with such words, word markers, like for, since, how long, lately, all day, all week, all months, etc. So, I haven't been feeling well lately. He's been annoying us all evening. She's been studying very hard for weeks. How long have you been playing golf? Then um, let's talk about difference, yeah, between present perfect simple or continuous, present perfect continuous. So uh, if we talk about the situations that started in the past and still continue, yeah, uh, we can use uh, both of these uh, tenses, but uh, we must use the present perfect simple with non-action verbs like stative verbs yeah and normally we use present perfect continuous with dynamic verbs uh, more about action and dynamic verbs like stative and non-stative verbs we discussed in the first lesson uh, when we talked about present simple present continuous okay again you can uh, go back and find it on my channel and re-watch it and uh, revise it um, so, we've had this car for years, so the verb have is stated verb, yeah, so that's why we uh, use uh, present perfect simple here, yeah, we have had this car for years, and I haven't been sleeping well lately, so the verb sleep is a dynamic verb, so we can use continuous, I haven't been sleeping well lately. Uh, yeah, so um, here we can use present perfect continuous, non, not simple. Yeah, with dynamic verbs for situations that started in the past and still continue when we want to emphasize yeah, how long the situation has lasted. For example, I've been waiting for hours. Yeah, I want to emphasize that I've been waiting for a long time. Yeah, for hours. Or I couldn't do the dishes, I've been working all day. Then we, uh, with the finished or unfinished situation, yeah, we can use um, present perfect simple 
yeah for finished actions in the past when we don't but we don't say when yeah and present perfect continuous for actions or situations that may have not finished yeah or maybe have finished but very recently so who has eaten my cookies yeah we would say this if there are no cookies left yeah the action is finished yeah and who has been eating my cookies we would say this if there are some cookies left yeah <laughs> still have some cookies and actions with present results so we can use present perfect simple and continuous for action with uh, present results and um we use present perfect yeah if the present result come from completing the action look at the example look how nice my car looks i've washed it yeah so the car looks nice because i have finished washing it yeah it it is washed and present perfect continuous we use if the present result comes from the process of doing the action sorry i'm so sweaty i've been washing my car yeah like i'm sweaty because of the physical activity yeah because of this process because of the process of washing the car then how long how much how many so uh we use present perfect continuous to talk about the duration yeah the duration of the action so how long we have been doing something yeah i've written 20 emails um uh, the second example yeah i've been writing emails for hours i'm talking about how long i spend writing emails yeah and the first example uh we use uh present perfect simple yeah because we're talking about how many things or how much yeah i've done yeah about like the result i've written 20 emails and yeah i'm talking about how many emails i've written yeah i'm i've written 20 emails and in the um second yeah sentence i've been writing emails for hours yeah, so here we have the emphasis on the duration yeah so that was it about the differences between present perfect simple and present perfect continuous you'll have the opportunity to uh, practice this material uh, following the link in the description uh, you can uh, do the exercises and uh, score the best mark and have a good day See you in the next videos. Bye-bye.